Well, Esty and Lola have found a scary fish, some homesick sea lions, and some very rare pups. All part of this week's edition of the News Hounds. Esty wants you to get a look at this scary eel-like fish. The ghost fish is named for its coloring and the fact that it has never been seen before alive. Images of this ghostly fish were captured in the Mariana Trench in the deepest part of the Western Pacific Ocean. The ghost fish is 10 centimeters long, has transparent gelatinous skin, and recessed eyes that lack pigment. Yikes! Lola reports some rescued sea lions are well enough to return to their ocean home. They were rehabbing at SeaWorld in San Diego for the past two to three months after they were found malnourished and dehydrated on local beaches this past spring. Once they're free, instinct takes over as they head back to the ocean, home sweet home. And speaking of homecomings, an elderly polar bear that spent years at an Indianapolis zoo is now roaming her new home at the Detroit Zoo. Tundra is 29 years old. She joins two 11-year-old bears, a male and female, as well as three foxes and five seals at the zoo's Arctic Ring of Life exhibit. From the look of things, Tundra is fitting right in. Welcome to CorgiCon 2016, where barking is encouraged. Hundreds of corgis and their two-legged owners enjoyed a lazy Saturday at the beach in San Francisco. The founder of CorgiCon got the idea for a convention when she noticed that corgi owners love to post pictures of these stubby-legged pups on social media. The convention includes a costume contest, lots of opportunities for photo shoots, and a fundraiser for Corgi Foundations. But in this crowd of corgis, Lola did spot an imposter, Slinky the Dachshund, which proves CorgiCon isn't just for corgi owners. It's also open to people who just love looking at these short, stout, and always smiling dogs. Finally, Esty says, get ready to say, aw. This is a litter of very rare doles, also known as Asian wild dogs. They're native to Southern and Eastern Asia, and this is the largest litter ever born in the United States. These 10 little guys were born at the Safari Park in San Diego. They behave like regular dogs, highly intelligent, highly social, and a little hyper. Doles are considered an endangered species with only about 2,500 left in the wild, but their cuteness isn't endangered. Three males, seven females, making up one adorable dog pot. And that's this week's edition of the News House. Don't you love sea lions? I love sea lions. And I love corgis, too. The corgi <laughs> con was what's, so cute. What's not to love yeah. with the News Hounds? Boy, we needed that today, didn't we? Yeah, it's been a rough week, and that's a good way to end it.